2023 for some was an incredible year. Now this was just me talking right here. For some it was an okay, all right year. Then for others it was a very challenging and difficult year. Whichever category you fit in, be encouraged for that year is now gone. That was me. 2024, believe for the more of God. In the midst of great persecutions, there's going to be great glory and harvest of souls. Many open doors of opportunities are going to swing wide open for you, but discern the open doors as not every open door is from the Lord. This is a time of war and warfare. It's a time for the watchmen to get back on their walls and begin to cry out to the Lord. Decree, declare, prophesy, pray, intercede, travail. This is a time for the worshipers and intercessors to receive their marching orders to march forth and begin to take back land in the spirit. It must first begin and start in the spirit before seeing it happen with the natural eyes. This is a year of exposure and the veil uh, being pulled off of many things that have been hidden. The Lord has shown mercy, but many have refused to repent. So things will come to the light that has been in the darkness. Outreach, evangelism, and soul winning will have a new impact on many people's hearts. The earth is going to increase its intensity of natural disasters because of the sin and shedding of innocent blood. And I have already mentioned that. Even though I'm very excited in my spirit about this year, at the same time I feel something in my spirit that's not good. There's an alarm going off in my spirit, and I'm not sure what it is. I sense that it's just over the horizon, maybe not too far into this year. The last time I felt something like this, it was at the end of 2019 and for the year of 2020. The enemy is planning something very evil. We as the body of Christ need to up our prayers lives in 2024. The enemy is not playing. Pray and receive strategies. The Lord wants to thwart the enemy's plans. But it takes intercession as the Lord partners with man. Some things are His will and other things can be stopped and changed through people's prayers. Stand guard against deception. It will continue to increase. Grab a hold of your anchor and sword, which is the Lord and His word. Stay close to both as they are inseparable. But don't make it that way. You know, don't make it that way. This, his presence and His word. They have to be together. Don't make it separate. This year will continue getting worse in the natural, but the Lord in the midst of all the craziness is going to move. Muslims, many, many Muslims are going to repent and turn to the Lord. There's a revival that is brewing among the Muslims. Favor, favor, favor. Know that my people have my favor, and my favor will manifest upon your lives in 2024. And then this is me. Let's press in for a mighty move of God in our families, cities, countries, nations in this year, 2024.